but take nothing away of a 29-34 performance. Flea Flecker, round three, back to Basilak, and then he goes to the outside. And the catch is made by Damon Hazelton, and he's going to have a first down up close to the 40-yard line. But, Stitch, I saw you kind of pointed that there was a, another player open downfield. Just didn't see him. And these are some of the, we'll call them trick plays, that they throw at you constantly. Missouri hit a flea flicker the last. Now here's a handoff to Tyler Beatty. And he's going to be in some trouble. Caught in the backfield and taken down for a major loss. Nice job by Kentucky's Jordan Wright. Serious medical condition. Yeah, great job of not only stringing this out, but Beatty, who is really explosive. Pressure again. It's over the middle for Damon Hazelton. A lot of ground to make up and won't get there. Tackled down the 49-yard line, so it's fourth down and 11. That's a nice opener for this possession for second and shorter. Keeper by Basilak, and he has the first down and running out at the midfield line. NC State, he's an athlete, though. Had a great day passing the other day. He's had a couple nice runs. One on a scramble this time. Basilak guns it out. Nice play here to Damon Hazelton. Had some blockers in front and gets up close to a first down for Missouri. And you start to see a few points in bunches. Yeah, and you wonder if we're going to jump into the tempo now with Missouri as they snap it quickly. Round three. First down and tripped up again. And you said you saw that coming. And that's the third time in a row they have barely tripped up round three as he got a nice burst of speed to the left side. Set up by that run to make it fourth and five. 12-yard reception. Now Basilak on the option gets it to Beatty down the sideline and pushed out inside the 10. 20 yards on that play to Tyler Beatty. Guard as well, and you see right at the end of the run. Oh, man. Mm. For an offense that has struggled to end up in the end zone. 11th play of the drive, third down. Basilak for Beatty, makes a spin move, stretches to the goal line, and he is just shy. Roundtree's back in. Roundtree, he is in. Touchdown, Missouri. Overcome a couple of penalties that sent him back. They pushed through. And Larry Roundtree, who, as we've mentioned, team plays for a total of 23 yards, and they now changed up the quarterback. So Joey Gatewood is in for Kentucky. Let's see if that changes things up. It's Rose, though, on the carry, and A.J. Rose is off to the races and pushed out of bounds in Mizzou territory. And that is a huge gainer on that one play. Nine. Yeah, the run game has been incredibly quiet. It was a great job by A.J. Rose of bouncing that run outside the back door. 50-yard attempt for Ruffalo, and it is good. He got it. And Kentucky's on the board with 8.24 to play first half. Good pitcher, right? Ruffalo, though, able to come in there and stripe it right down the middle. Here they come. Gatewood sacked. Nick Bulletin. What a day he's had. In the run game, but here, watch as they wrap all the way around. Not only Bolton getting home, well, players John after the play, Mizzou's ready to play. Back to Roundtree, and he is wrestled down by Phil Hoskins. It's the left tackle. He misses the block on Hoskins. He's the one that makes this play. His only miss is from 56 in that LSU game two weeks ago. It's third down. Basilak eludes pressure, throws on the run, has a man, and it's Kiki Chisholm who makes the catch. And it's a first down inside the red zone. That's good for 25. Watch number one come firing into your screen. Basilak flushes up in the pocket, on the run. He's able to throw to his right a strike. Field goal attempt for Harrison Mevis, five of six on the season. And now six of seven. So it's 10 to three, Missouri. They're gonna get the ball to start the second half. And the first run here 
And it's Roundtree, and he's going to be ripped down for a loss of a yard. And that was J.J. Weaver that time on the stop. Ray Roundtree sells it like he's got the football. Roundtree does have it now, and he's going to be taken down behind the line. Nice job, Kentucky. And leading the charge, Marquan McCall, among others there. Watch the line of scrimmage go backwards. Look at McCall. I mean, Larry Roundtree, he doesn't end up making the initial strike, does McCall? And three on fourth down. Keeper, Basilak, and he's going to be dropped, and Kentucky's going to take over on downs. That was Yusuf Corker, and that was the 21st play of this drive to start this third quarter, and Missouri's going to come up empty. Missouri grinding it out on the third quarter. Possession. Look at Kentucky bowing their necks and getting a stop. Missouri back on offense. Connor Basilak has a wide open man. It's Knox. He's got it. Jalen Knox. And he's down to the Kentucky 34 yard line for a first and more. And why not? Because it'd be going forward on fourth down anyway if you don't get this. But Jalen Knox by himself. It's Jordan Wright and in front of the corner. 18 first downs to four for Kentucky. And now it's Roundtree. And after the 27-yard gain, Roundtree rips off a 17-yard gain. Basilak to Roundtree. Touchdown, Missouri. His second today. Third time's a charm. Third trip into the red zone, second time. 45 seconds left, Kentucky from the 25-yard line. Here's Rodriguez in the handoff, trying to make something happen, and that's a good start. Up to the 42, gain of 17. The Missouri yes. defensive line. Look at that, it's a wall of white. Start of the game, it was replaced by Joey Gatewood for a couple of series. Now he's back in here, taking a shot to the end zone. Has a man, he's got it. It is a touchdown to Josh Ali. 26 yard strike. Matched up with the true freshman, Ennis Rakestraw. And he runs like what is effectively a wheel route. Well, let's not forget the injured player was Devontae Robinson who went to the sideline. They were working on his shoulder, so he is out right now for Kentucky. So that's without his services in the secondary. And now here's a carry, and it is Beatty, and he's going to be pushed out of bounds. But gets close to pay dirt, and he's going to pick up a first down. He gets to the four-yard line. The sticks move. It is first and goal coming up for the Tigers. Ten, you get a run for ten plus. Great job on the right side of the Missouri offensive front. Beatty's clean has been reversed. Missouri taking on the offensive identity of their opponent. Tyler Beatty on the carry, and this time the defense of the Wildcats stops him in his tracks. It's a loss of one. The kick is good. 20 to 10, Missouri, 3.07 to go, and we will be back. Could have preserved some clock right there, it seemed, and, and didn't. And now Gatewood coming back in to try to bail out the offense late. Gatewood gets it over to Josh Ali, who has the lone touchdown for Kentucky, and then the ball come out. Let's see. Get up to the 37-yard line. It would be a first down. Now the officials are talking it over. Can't tell when it comes out. It definitely comes out at the end. Couldn't tell from that look. Josh Bledsoe on a tackle. Oh, yeah, from there. He had gotten in there and knocked that ball free. Well, Bledsoe had his hand on it early, you could tell. Right there, that ball's coming out. I think he, I don't think he's down yet. His butt hitting the ground would have established him down. But I think the ball was already coming out. But as we've seen earlier in this game, yeah. 
I, I think he actually loses control clearly right there earlier with, with Tyler Beatty. Missouri is going to snap a five win streak for Kentucky in this series. Going to be their first win since the 2014 season over the Kentucky Wildcats. And the Tigers get it done today here at home. 20 to 10. The final as they improve the two and two on the season. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.